Hi, I'm in Croatia, in Pula. And I'm on vic and I'm on and I'm on vacation. Filming crafting videos on vacation is tricky because you didn't bring all the materials you would want you would need to create something. But I had an idea. What if I go into dollar store and buy all the materials there? I give myself 10 minutes for 10 dollars, 10 euros to pick something up and then craft something interesting with it to maybe inspire you to create and craft on your vacation. We have barely started our trip uh, and one kid is already crying and the other one has to go poop. So, yeah. I just left my kids and my wife at McDonald's, which means I have approximately 15 minutes to do the $1 store raid. We'll go into the store called Teddy. We have 10 minutes, I have to be quick and I'll try to get everything for $10. I didn't really have the plan going into the store, but I knew I wanted to get one of those wooden box to start with. Also knew I will need some sort of colors. And you will see me picking up some metallic colors that I just didn't use in the end. I only have one euro left for the challenge. I'm not too sure I'll make it. Because everything was pretty pricey, I just decided to grab this chalk and make some sort of clay with it. Here you go, you can take it. Oh, thank you. This is the thing we bought from the store and we'll need some additional materials. So we have oil, toilet paper and some brushes. I also took chalk and already grinded it down, so we have a chalk powder. So with all these materials I just decided to make some sort of pirate chest and I needed to make myself a clay, air drying clay. And while I was in store I remember I saw a video from Creative Cat where she made air drying clay. And I knew I needed glue, I needed toilet paper, oil and I needed some chalk powder. Here things got a little bit complicated. I didn't have enough chalk powder and everything was really really sticky. And the chalk powder that I used had little rocks in it and was bumpy. So I added flour. Next up was carving up the box. I basically just tried to make it look like a chest. Like a large planky chest. For the bigger grooves I just used exacto knife. And for the smaller details I just pressed really hard with a pencil. This was the first time of me making this clay and actually using it. And uh, I think I ruined it with the flower, but it was still workable and I could still add details. It felt like a little bit inflated after I added the flower and it was not sticking to the actual chest, so I just glued it on. If you're ever in doubt what to do next, just just add more details. I was so excited to start coloring this because I knew once I added the colors it will look just amazing. To add shadow and depth to the color you just need to use wash and you can make your own wash by mixing soap, water and color. For the finishing touches I just used white color and dry brush the whole thing and it looked mwah. Ooh, look at this! Isn't it great? Isn't it beautiful? I like it very much. I hope you like it too. And I will see you next episode. Please 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 subscribe because I need 9 more subscribers to surpass my co-worker.